Uh, well, um, hi guys. Oh god, oh god. Uh, so I recorded a full 30 minute video, and as I was going for a drink of water, I noticed a certain flashing in my OBS with desktop audio. So what that means is I had my Spotify on the entire time. Meaning they were going to mute my video or they were going to basically hit me with a copyright strike or something because the music was really loud. Um, it was from the Marshall Mathers LP 2 by Eminem. So uh, I fucked up really bad. Sorry everyone, that is really disappointing because I hate that because I had music on that I didn't see, I basically just can't upload that shit. Um, I decided to cut my losses at 27 minutes of un 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 completely wasted footage where I went through uh, the Abyss rune, I got the third rune with no hassle pretty much. I didn't kill a single enemy, so it wasn't actually that bad. Um, I didn't kill a single enemy. Um, other than in the rune vault, and uh, then I did snake three, sorry, snake four to get the third rune, and then I picked up shadow creatures, I found Sabojo, and he almost, like, he didn't kill me, but, like, he's just too dangerous for me to fight. I then cleared, like, Zot a little bit, so I'll just show you what I've looked at, like, there's a little pretty open diamond thing, pretty quick upstairs, pretty quick upstairs, right? Like, and I was just explaining to the people, to the, to you guys, that, um, oh man, fuck, man. Oh, I'm so fucking sad. Because this was like, I was finished with the video. I was like, just like, oh yeah, I'll just do Zot 5 and then I'll just chill out at 40 minutes. It's a good video, it's just the end, you know, there's nothing too crazy, like the length is good. And then now I got fucking obliterated. Like, this is, this is the kind of shit that makes me just not want to upload this entire run. Like, I, I was, I actually, like, I'm so fucking tilted by it, because what, what happened is, I, I took a nap, right? So it was, it was 7 o'clock, it's 10.46 right now, but it was 7 o'clock at the time. I was playing uh, music on my, my, my computer, and I was like, alright, I'm gonna go take a nap for a bit. Turn my computer, uh, like, put it to sleep, pretty much. Um, and then I just kind of, like, went to sleep, woke up, and then I was like, I didn't put my earphones in, because I, I didn't bother to check. I assumed that when you sleep, and then you come back, the fucking computer isn't gonna stop playing your music, your music again. It doesn't make any fucking sense why I would do that. Like, it's just like, oh, you were, you were gone, and now you're back. Here, let me just not tell you that I'm just gonna fucking play all the music again. Pause that shit, you fucking idiot. Um, so yeah, that was just playing through the entire undercurrent of my my video and because it was on loud because of course when i listen to music i don't consider what it sounds like on audio because it only really balances around me i basically was interrupted by the song for the entire recording and i actually listened to the to the video um briefly before starting this recording and it is really overpowering and it's very obvious that the youtube algorithm will fuck me in the butthole so um, in order to protect my anal virginity, um, I was like, no, you will not be destroying my, my channel's purity. No, thank you. I am a channel with good standing. Thank you. I'm not going to be demonetized. You will actually, uh, give me the two cents per video that you have chosen to give me, and you will refuse to give me that money until I make a hundred dollars. Thank you, YouTube. <sighs> God. Anyway. Like, fuck me, why? God, I'm, oh. So we're going into this video a little hot, a little hot, a little, little hot, but thankfully we have RF Triple Plus because we ended up picking up that Ring of Kobavad from last video, Fly, RF Double Plus, RC Plus. We just got a little bit of money, you know, pulled together some funds, grabbed a, grabbed a double RF ring, it's all good. Everything else is pretty much the same. I found a Shield of Reflection, I just upped that to five because there was nothing else to train. Um, I one shot an orb of fire in Zot. That's pretty much it. Like I've just, I've basically give you a rundown on everything that happened so far because I'm just so annoyed by this. 
I really wish that there was a way for you to separate Spotify tracks from, um, like, I wish the, 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 the algorithm was smart enough to, like, actually understand, hey, wait a minute, uh, I can just peel away this fucking, this audio from your video that was related to the copyrighted material, thank you for coming. But no, unfortunately, we are stuck with this situation where it'll just be like, eh, fuck you, dude. And then uh, demonetize or whatever the hell it wants to do to me. <sighs> so, you know, I'm, I'm upset. I, I'm, I'm not going to lie. I'm a little upset. I am. I'm definitely not in the greatest of, uh, of, of, of moods, I suppose. Because I, I think I even told the story and it was pretty funny. Like, I'm not, I'm not saying it was great, but, you know, I... I had a fun time talking about it, and now I've forgotten about it because it literally just happened, and I assume that I spent my cartridges. I was like, I don't. Ah, oh, great! I don't have to tell that story anymore. I just told it. Awesome. But uh, you know, that that's a lost footage archives thing. I, the Patreon only, apparently, because that's uh, all I got. <sighs> anyway, hey, there's an ancient lich. Uh, remember what uh, liches get? You know what they say? Liches get s stitches because they get bitten by snakes. Mana snakes. Uh, yeah, so I'm just filling this corridor with a couple of cheeky, you know, cheeky mana vipers. And the mana vipers are going to prohibit the lich from really doing much. And I'm just going to summon more mana vipers. And as you can see, that's really, really effective against uh, pretty much everything in this place, which is cool. Mana vipers do good damage have anti-magic bites, and they're pretty, just all around quite, uh, you know, sensual. I like it. Uh, okay, well, my shadow creature has summoned an orb of fire. I'm just gonna go ahead and let him deal with the ancient lich. Sure. I'm very sure you know what you're doing, ancient lich, and I will, oh, sorry, uh, orb of fire, and I will just get out of your way. Okay, cool. So, strategy here. I talked a lot about transitioning uh, as an enchanter. Some people go to summons, some people pick up a weapon, some people, you know, they just believe in, in summoning so hard that they they just continue the fight forever. Me, I'm going the summoning route, it's very consistent, it's uh, very strong, uh, Mana Vipers is incredible, and if I get Shadow Creatures like this, I can just kind of shit on this Orb of Fire with no real repercussion. Uh, I do have a little bit of an annoying, like, mutation set, that's fine though. Okay, so the fact that all these guys are coming towards me right now, uh, all these orbs of fire, is pretty good. It's actually pretty good because it means that the orbs of fire are getting like kind of smashed out of the uh, out of the orb chambers by some force, probably like a tele trap or something, and I'm just reaping the benefit of that uh, because they will, you know, pretty much just all follow me. Oh shit, I actually don't have any mana, I just realized that. Uh, I, I don't have any blood, I need some blood. Alright, this guy's not giving me blood, I'm pretty upset about that, it's fine. There we go. Got three potions of blood from that, sweet. Uh, sorry, what was I talking about? Yeah, the fact that I found so many orbs of fire and ancient liches is pretty nice for us, because it means that, uh, at least for the time being, there are going to be a lot of things coming out of these orb chambers, and then my eventual run will be nicer. You can see that I'm kind of being really strong right now like it doesn't it shouldn't this character has no business being this good but because i have shadow creatures and mana vipers i just kind of shit all over this place even though i have no real like i said i have no real business being this good against those enemies i'm actually going to quaff potion of mutation here just to get rid of some of those bad mutes this is kind of nice having four extra ac very good for us <sighs> all right I'm, I'm bloodless again i should probably just pop up and grab something if i can just a quick quick snack if I can, you know, go invis a little bit, stab a couple of boys, you know, grab a bit of blood, you know, I want to make sure that I can regen if possible, I'm going to bottle all these guys up, I have one potion of blood, thank you very much game, you fucking asshole, that's not an enemy, <sighs> like, this is why the blood mechanic is just really shit to me, let's be real, like, the blood mechanic is not a good mechanic, it is just annoying at its core, um, like, I don't even know where the fuck I'm supposed to find more blood now. I'm bloodless, I'm just basically in this situation where I have to kind of just go find blood. And if I'm in a vault that just doesn't get me blood, 
Fuck me, I guess. Like, you're just an idiot. Don't. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go find some excess blood. This is just foolish. I don't like this. This is like the example of a bad mechanic here. Like, blood mechanic, not interesting. Not fun. Just, come on now. Just get me some excess blood, please. I'll go fight these guys, even though I really don't want to. Okay, that's a berserk gold dragon. I'm gonna keep summoning stuff to make sure I don't die, and then I'm gonna eat his corpse. He's gonna give me blood. Thank you very much. Uh, I'm just gonna keep going in the hopes that I can get some more cheeky blood if I can. Be nice. To get shadow creatures to kill these guys. Low cost. Ah, oh, more guys to stab. Excellent. I'm gonna invis again. Uh, that's probably not a smart idea, but I'm gonna do it anyway, just because I can get some kills. I just need more blood, you see. Like, blood is very important for me as a uh, individual. Okay, cool. Just did a quick blood drive, you know. Um, but in, in this industry, it's actually called a blood drive buy. It's actually not a blood drive. It's pretty interesting. Uh, the culture is just very different for a vampire. You know, you just come in, collect that blood, and you're like, ooh, for me? Thank you. Very delicious. Okay, now I have blood, I can actually regen. I can play as a real character now, which is good. Uh, not, not always is this possible. Okay, uh, there's a bunch of guys here. This character is, as you can see, still very shit at dealing with enemies head on, but with a little bit of trickery and a lot of uh, luck, we can just kind of blast through this area anyway. Like this is this is as close as you'll get to like a specify uh, a specialized orb of fire killer. Uh, my whole gear is just towards like killing one or two specific enemies. It's pretty nice actually. Wow, that's a lot of orbs of fire today. Jeez. We are in Orb Town. Okay, I am bloodless. I drink a drink a potion here. Drink a potion of might just to punch this guy up. I just need to kill something here. Come on. Uh, I kind of want a magic. I'm going to do that now. I just need to kill him. There we go. Cheese. Okay, well, we lost. We got mad mutated there, which is pretty sad. But, okay, whatever. We'll have to just cop it, I think. Do we really not get any, like, mutation resistance as we're if we're undead? That makes no sense at all. We're, like, fully undead. One more bloodless. Okay, so we have Frail 20%. That's good enough for me to just start spamming mutes. I need to get rid of Frail 20%. Okay, there we go. That's good. Alright, see? So the problem that I have, like, one of the problems that I have with the mutation system is kind of just that situation where, like, I only give a shit about one exact mutation, and because I have to get rid of one exact mutation, I don't give a single shit about any of the other ones. Like, Frail? Awful. Like, terrible. Never do, right? But all the other ones, inconsequential. It just has a really bad... It, it's a really bad feeling to just have to, you know, completely ignore everything else in the mutation system because you can't influence the effect of one. So, you know, ideally in, in Crawl 2.0, uh, in Crawl 2, um, we will be able to see, you know, some improvements on the system as, as such. Okay, I'm going to back off here summon one shadow creatures I was a little afraid there that I was gonna summon a uh, berserk moth but you know that that worked out pretty well for us okay just chilling just backing off no need to be like super crazy right now maybe summon one or two shadow creatures again I'm trying not to go too hard on shadow creatures because if I do I might accidentally summon something bad um, again I don't have any blood which pisses me off because now the orb runs gonna be annoying uh, just channel scrying here. So the scrying is good because it just kind of gives me an idea of what's up there. Uh, this is a very bad situation to be in. I'm just going to haste here and then I'm going to back off. I feel genetically stable. Well, I do. Thank you very much. Okay, well, I'm near bloodless again, so my regen is fucked. Um, back off here, summon shadow creatures again. I'm just gonna spam shadow creatures until eventually something kills it. There we go, nice. 
And uh, thanks to the power of the almighty Zot, I'm going to have to continue going for another blood drive. Do another quick, you know, campaign, quick donation. You know, hey, do you want to donate some blood to the cause? Stab some people when they're sleeping, siphon some blood gently from their veins, you know, the usual. Just very ethical, they signed a waiver. You know, they didn't, but, you know, I... Them being in Zot basically signs the waiver. So, you know, it was all legally done if, uh... If by legal, I mean completely illegal. And if by done, I mean uh, non-consensually. So, you know, eh, if you think about it, in, in certain in certain cultures, I'm actually in the right. I'm the victim here. I'm a victim of um, this brutal disease, this degenerative disease where I have to drink blood to uh, heal. <laughs> so, you know, it's not... Uh, it's like, how many potions have you uh, drunk? How many, how many lives have you taken to feed your horrible blood addiction? Well, you know... How much bread have you eaten in your life? You know what I mean? How much? The answer is, you know, I can't count. I forgot. Because, you know, bread, it's irrelevant. It's really, it's really not a statistic that people think about. When you eat a piece of bread, you're like, ooh, did I just, ooh, I just ate that bread. I don't, I don't count. Oh, I had two breads this week. No, you just eat the bread and you're like, ah, whatever, fuck it. And I'm the same way. You know, when it comes to blood, I'm just like, hmm, yum, delicious. Blood, all right, done. Nice open shut, open shut, close, uh, open and close. Was it open and shut? I don't know what the fuck I'm talking about. Oh, that's a berserk moth. Um, gotta f end this fight real quick before the fucking orb guardians go berserk. If they go berserk, I basically die. Um, one of the very quick dangers of, uh, one of the very awful dangers of having a fucking. No, we need to leave. Oh, that's really bad. Okay, okay, the cursed hoe is saving us. Wow, three fucking, three fucking, uh, what do you call it, berserk moths in a row, or in, in the last four casts, that's so unlucky, holy shit, that was, that was brutal. Like, th it, it's times like this where I'm like, okay, maybe I shouldn't use shadow creatures at all. Like, when you just get a whole bunch of berserk moths next to a fucking orb guardian, you're like, man, this is just brutal. Okay, well, you know, it's actually been a 20 minute long video, so, you know, I'm actually not that bad. I'm gonna go ahead and just haste out. I don't want to be here anymore. I don't want to fight this orb of fire. There's no reason to. I just need to leave, you know what I mean? I just need to go home. So, the orb run for most characters is pretty okay. We have a decent amount of stealth here. Unfortunately, holding the orb makes you less stealthy, so we actually can't run away quite as easily as we would like to, but, you know, at the same time, we can... Uh, we can get some stuff done. It's pretty good. Okay, so Shadow Creatures, I need to remind myself that uh, it actually becomes a lot worse when I, over time. So I need to kind of remember that if I leave Depths, I will be much... Uh, the, the spell itself will be a lot worse than it normally would be. I'm just going to go up here. I don't know why it became... Oh, it didn't. Oh, okay, I see. Uh, okay. See, like, right now, Shadow Creatures is good, still. It still summons, like, a decent amount of stuff. But once I get to, say, for example, Dungeon, I need to remember to use Mana Vipers instead. Because Shadow Creatures will no longer summon anything of real value. Uh, where's my upstairs? Okay, it's pretty far away. I'm gonna have to just run for it. Summon Mana Vipers on the way out, just to make sure that I don't get stabbed to death. Uh... Okay, I can just pray here that I don't get killed. That's a pan lord. I'm gonna haste. Arguably not worth it, but hey, whatever. It's fine. Okay, I need blood now. I really need blood. It's possible. I'm gonna use my mana vipers to hopefully distract. Didn't work. Alright, potion of might. We need to kill this executioner before he just chops us up, pretty much. Okay, we are now bloodless, so we no longer regen. We do have torment resist, though, which is good. I guess. I'm gonna just close the door in this tits middle, and then run away. Use teleport to escape, evade the opponent. Okay, this lack of regen is just so... Ah, oh, man. And, like, the fact that I'm not finding any blooded opponents is just so irritating, because, like, I basically can't heal now. Oh my 
I need to teleport here. Like, give me some blood, please god. Why am I not getting any blood? This is actually so upsetting me. Like, this is really upsetting. I'm just gonna start quaffing haste now. Uh, curing. To heal. Like, this is so stupid. The fact that I just have to blow a bunch of consumables because I didn't- I got the bad RNG to just not get anything blooded. And I have to fight this idiot. Okay. Like, mentally, this is so taxing. To have to fight opponents when you know you can't regen anymore, and to have them be the same fucking opponent that is clearly, like, way stronger than you should- it should be. Let me f fucking- oh, give me the blood, you assholes. Just need to run here. Like, if the final boss shows up, we lose. Like, that's just depressing. Let me fucking bleed, what's this guy saying? No digging, no. Man, fuck me. Oh wait, these guys are... Why did I X this guy off? Oh, it's Sigmund! <gasps> we can eat him! I'm gonna fucking break his neck with my fangs. God, yes. Give me your fucking... Oh, give me your blood, you idiot. He didn't give me any blood. You asshole, you fucking prick. Oh, you gecko? Give me the blood. Give me your blood. Oh, he, you brought your friends. You brought your fucking friends, too. God damn it. Oh, well, that scroll summoning was very disappointing. Okay, let me pull back for a sec here. Confuse you, stab you. Eat your fucking corpse. There we go, that's what I like to see. Now I'm regening. Now we're, now we're like a real character almost. Um, just permacost regen. Running away, running away, running away. No final boss. Oh, thank fucking god. Holy shit, that was so fucking stressful. Like, not regening is a pain in the dick. Why do they make this mechanic happen? You can't choose your blood level. It's so annoying. God. What's this guy saying? Thanks. Um, what an annoying mechanic. What a shit mechanic. Like, I just... I just tried so hard to get food, can't get food. It's like, why do they make corpse RNG plus uh, a mechanic that means that you blood, like, if you're bloodless, you don't regen. Like, wh why? <laughs> a match made in hell, truly. Oh, God. I'm actually so tilted by that because, like, only two thirds of the video is actually, sorry, a third of the video is actually being recorded. We lost the rest of the footage to a horrible, tragic accident. A music related one that's so depressing can we hit 55 million likes yes <sighs> all right well that's it for today guys sorry about the shorter video i'm really annoyed by it too this character fucking pissed me off but hey we did it it's finally done vampire enchanter over um we'll see what we do tomorrow i don't know i have no idea anyway goodbye